Moin Moin and greetings. So in the past we had a look at yeah, mainly Phoenix flashlights and I thought it would be um, a good idea to bring up something something new and yeah I think most of you know Nightcore it's um, they, they, they put in a lot of effort to bring out many good and new flashlights in the past with um, several new features like for this TM26 series the OLED display and um, built-in charging system and a very compact size new LEDs like uh, for this one the XPL high LED so why not start with this little monster the tiny monster sorry not little monster first like in the past we will have a look at the package there we got it 3500 lumens and 704 meters which is quite a lot quite a lot for especially for such a small flashlight with, with uh, so small reflectors inside so that's it for the package and of course we got a spare um, o-ring lanyard and um, a rubber protection cap for the charging slot which is quite nice we got an adapter for charging the flashlight in the car the charger itself this is a U, uh, U version and a pretty nice holster so build quality looks really nice we got the nightcore logo here open on the downside yeah pretty nice but let's come back to this <laughs> the tiny monster so most important in my eyes is the head there you can see the four XPL high LEDs and the reflector got um, they got a little peeling little orange peel but it's only very very low aluminium housing hard anodized two stage switch OLED display which can be activated here I locked it out there's the display in light core nothing special on the back tail stand is no problem And let's have a look, short look at the inside. Make sure to keep the head up so the batteries will not fall out. And it's important to use um, batteries with button top, not the flat top. Otherwise you might get a problem with um, get the connection here. Or you would have to use some magnets, but it's not that good, I think best is to look for button top batteries maybe just by the night core I used my AV batteries get in here so no springs in the back first I tried to use my IMR batteries but they were um, not big enough they did not fit they rattled in the inside and nothing happened so have a look at the OLED display when I make the connection there we got it light core I just charged to the batteries a few minutes ago for this test and we got um, two modes two main modes so one is the daily mode and you can activate it when uh, press down the button only halfway like this so it starts with three lumens which is quite low and here you can see the information about runtime um, heat and which mode is activated see it here 
voltage, capacity, runtime, and temperature. And um, to change the, change the mode, you just have to press it again shortly. And we go to 95 lumens, 440, and 1700 lumens. So and if you want to activate the stroke mode, you have to press it down to the, uh, to the bottom for two times. Oh, a little faster. I was not... I made it too slow. Strobes activated, press it shortly again, SOS, and again for beacon mode. So, and switch it on. The last mode will be activated, memory mode, and switch it off again. And now we will try the search mode. So, and to activate it, you have to press it down completely for a short moment only. 3500 lumens, press again 1700 lumens and it's also, possibly, also possible to um, activate momentary on and to, to, to do so you have to press and hold so last mode 1700 lumens we can do like this and change it 95 and now we have momentary with 95 lumens so and you can do the same for the search mode just have to press it full and there it goes again so and another feature is um, the lockout mode so when flashlight is activated, like now, you have to press and hold for about a second. And the light will flash up for uh, two times and uh, you will get the information lockout is activated. So and no matter which button you press now, you will just get the information that lockout is activated. There will be a short, uh, a little current running all the time to keep up the electronic board inside. And to, um, to take out the lockout mode, you have to press it for one second again. And there you go. You can also do the, shock, uh, the lockout like this. So there will be no current at all running so for longer storage I would suggest to do it like this yeah that's it for this little tiny monster little tiny monster that's a little too much right um, beside that we got a thermal protection so when temperature is getting too high above 60 degree Celsius um, it will lower the output. It's the same like for, for Fenix um, or for other brands. Um, beside the Nightcore I also had um, a Lupine TL2 which is even smaller and will be um, yeah, about the same when it comes to output but it will not win the race when it's coming to, um, to the range. So this TM26 GT will shoot out much farther than um, the Lupine. Yes, I think that's it for uh, for this flashlight. Um, the price in Germany is around uh, 400 euro, and you also have to think about the batteries. You need the batteries, so all in all, it will be around 500 euro. You don't need the charger because you got it here. So you can save the costs on this and you can also use this one here for photography or uh, for other lighting purposes. Yes, I think that's it. Um, so maybe I'm using this for lighting up. But 
here you got a reference when it's coming to size. This is a Fenix TK75, so you can see it deserves the name Tiny. Much more compact. And for compersion I will hold it in my hands, in my hand. So it's okay to take with you every day, especially in the holster. So the big question, who needs a flashlight like this? Well, I think 90% um, of the people do not really need it. It's, uh, it's more like something to enjoy on the electronic, on the high output, maybe on the OLED display. Um, but beside that, it's not just a toy, uh, because the distance you can light up is quite amazing, also when it's not 704 meters, it will be less, but it's the same for, for all other manufacturers. Um, I think it will be a very good companion for, yeah, for people maybe that have a dog or um, have a bigger property they have to, to look after. And um, if you also like to have something you can play around a little, um, maybe this flashlight could be interesting for you. So that's it for the moment. Thank you and bye-bye.